I got the vapors. I used to smoke six, but now I got flavors. Welcome back, vape heads. This is Cubs here. So, uh, got some more great juices for you. I've got a complete line, well, almost complete line from Azul Vapor today. Uh, I think you guys are going to enjoy this one. Some very nice, complex juices, uh, very smooth. I think you'll enjoy it. So, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so Savannah Dream is the first juice from Azul Vapor. You guys will see that in the background you have blue bottles. This is actually Azul's line. However, they've revamped it recently. I'm really digging the new flavors that they have out. They've got some of their flagship flavors that have converted over to the new ones. And then they have uh, some new flavors. So, this first flavor is Savannah Dream. Now, Savannah Dream is a it's a peach. It's like uh, not so much the candy peach where it tastes. It has that like fake sugar, uh, fake sweetener taste to it. I'm sure you've had the little peach O's. It's more of a candy peach. Peachy flavor, but it doesn't have that fake sweetener taste to it. It's a sweet vape. Uh, very good. Drips very well. If you're using it in a cardo, you're going to get a lot of great flavor from it. I would definitely su suggest this one. Uh, don't mind the background noises. <laughs> I would definitely suggest this one to anybody that enjoys a nice peach flavor. It's not a very complex flavor. It's a very simple flavor. Uh, it's candy peach, but not that fake candy peach flavor. So go ahead and check that one out. I'm going to leave, of course, as always, links below. Uh, I'm going to have some additional links today for some other people. Uh, and yeah, let's keep the, the party going. So on my trusty 4.9, I've got Eye of Newt. Eye of Newt. Uh, Eye of Newt, I really enjoy it. It's the one I've been vaping the most. It's a tobacco, a simple tobacco, uh, kind of hearty, thick, bold tobacco but it has a hint of, well, not a hint. There's a nice little bit of, of, uh, like cooling sensation, menthol, but it's very good. It's not too bad. It's not overpowering on the menthol. Just enough to clean out your sinuses a little, not really strong. It's not the type of menthol where you're going to choke on it. If you like men menthol tobaccos, it's no cool cigarette, it's no camel menthol, but it is a tobacco menthol and it's very good. It's very light. Cardo's awesome. Tank, awesome. Dripping, even better. Moving on ahead. I've got seven juices here, so I have to do four now and then three more in another video. Or the same video, but I have to stop and reset everything. So the last one was Eye of Newt. This one is Fruit Rapture. Now Fruit Rapture has a hint of watermelon and berries. It's a sweet vape. Everybody loves the smell of this one. All my non-smoker, non-vaping friends, they love the smell of this one. Definitely a great vape. It's, uh, I believe it is watermelon and berries. Let's take a look here. Fruit Rapture. Water, watermelon and ber berries. 
So this is originally one of their flagship flavors. Uh, they've revamped some of the, the mixes on it, on them recently. All their juices are fairly high PG. You can tell by, or high VG, sorry. You can tell by how thick the juice is, but it's another great, great vape. All of their juices, if you're using a Cardo, you're going to love them. If you're using a Tank, you're going to love them. And I'm repeating myself as usual, but uh, it's great juice. Definitely try it out. Try it out. This is a nice uh, break from the last video that I recorded. I was not happy with it, unfortunately. But uh, I got to be honest with you guys. I'm not going to tell you guys go out and try a flavor and go out and... and and buy something and waste money on crap this these juices are not crap uh, definitely worth giving a try definitely worth picking up if you don't have a shop that carries them around the uh, website has a list of shops that carries them don't pay attention to the the juices that are listed on the shop on the the website so much because the names have changed but uh, you can contact any of the shops that have and carry their juice and you can get it through them. This one's kind of self-explanatory. It's Wicked Berry. It's berries. Very good juice. Uh, another sweet juice. I really enjoy this one, but it's leading up to uh, my favorite. So, all of these juices have great vapor production, but uh, wild berry or wicked berry, self explanatory, it's berries, it's good flavor, great vapor production, really good juice. All right, so the next juice is called purple decadence now here's the thing if you're not asian you probably have no idea what this is this is taro taro is a purple yam or purple potato that a lot of asian cultures use in desserts uh they use it for everything but they use it a lot in desserts To me, this one, I get the, the taro. Taro's uh, not easy to pull off, by the way. But I also get a little hint of coconut, but that could be just part of the taro. Either way, it's very smooth. It's really good. I enjoy dripping this one a lot. You may lose a little if you do it in a tank or a, a coil system, cardo. But it does have strong enough flavor that uh, it still would be worth giving it a try. I really enjoy, I really enjoy these flavors. Uh, I have had a chance to try them prior to doing the review. I tried their their flagship flavors. Uh, this next one is one of my all time favorites. Sorry, my little. Uh, ghetto rig paper washer to prevent this from auto firing if anybody has issues with auto firing 49 take a business credit card or a couple of layers of paper make a little washer and you won't have any issues this one think of like cinnabon if you've ever had cinnabon and think of like banana nut bread fused together. It's one of the best flavors I've had. I say that a lot about a lot of juices, don't I? Well, I've had a lot of best flavors, but uh, this is one of my favorites as well. If people are looking for a banana nut flavor, 
I would definitely go with this. Word of advice for anybody that's allergic to cinnamon, you know who I'm talking to. Uh, can't drip this one. You can't use this one. There is just a hint of cinnamon. You get the banana. It's not overpowering. You get the bread. It's a great combination. It's a very complex flavor, and they've done it really, really well. If they don't change anything, it's on point. And this flavor, it's one of my favorites to drip. If you use an Encardo, it's going to be fine. Uh, you're going to get better flavor, though, from dripping. It works really well if you like to build those really low builds, the point twos. Uh, it's good shit. And the last one, I got a lot of these recently of the same type of flavor, uh, Andy's mint type flavor, chocolate and mint. Now, the first one that I got of this was when it was there, when they were first starting off, it was on point. It was an Andy's Mint, chocolate and mint. Now, they've revamped this flavor a little, and I hate to say it, but it's too minty for me. I like to taste more of the chocolate. It's not a bad flavor, but it's really hard to vape uh, when you drip it. The mint is really strong. It actually makes my chest hurt a little. Uh, not bad though, like the, if you used it in a Cardo, this would be on point. If you like chocolate and mint, this would be great for you. Uh, the Cardo is going to take away from some of the, the mintiness, but for dripping it, it's a little bit more difficult. You'll see. I'm not taking huge puffs on it because... I'll die. If you use it in a Cardo, it's going to be on point for you. The chocolate's there. It's not trying. You don't have any flavor that doesn't match. You don't get any weird, like, secondary flavors. But uh, the chocolate's there. I would like a little bit more chocolate. When they first had it come out, there was more chocolate flavor to it, but it's still good. But the menthol for dripping, it's a little bit difficult. <clears throat> it's not really a menthol, it's mint, and the mint is a little bit harsh, but still overall a good flavor. I would definitely suggest it for Cardo's right now. If they change it up, then uh, make it a little bit less minty, minty, then it'll be very good. So the juice, freaking get it. Go out, buy it, try it, love it, enjoy it, tell your friends about it. Do it, please. Now, on to some more pressing stuff. Where I'm at with my timer. Okay, I got a couple minutes. Let me catch my breath. Eric, Eli, Brent, Roxanne, Crystal, Erica, David, Ignacio, Carrie. Thank you all. I'm not going to say your last names. For sending out those emails to your favorite juice companies. A lot of them have uh, contacted me back. So look for some upcoming juice videos with your favorite juice company. And then, also, I want to say congratulations to Zach at, over at iPuff and Play. His video reviews are starting to get going. He's gathering more followers on Facebook right now. So if you have a chance to check him out, his Facebook is iPuff and Play. I-P-U-F-F -F, space in space play. I'll have a link below. Also, feel free to check out his YouTube great videos. They're short, they're sweet. Uh, it's under Sweet Nectar Vape. 
either way, I'll have a link below. And that's it, guys. Uh, you guys have been great. As usual, thank you guys. Please follow, share, subscribe, what everybody else says. Uh, and I look forward to more vapies. If you guys want to know, I'm trying to coin a term here. Vapies. A vaping selfie. Come on. And uh, more hand checks. I love them. I love putting them on my videos. Uh, the more the merrier. Keep them going. I'll probably just have a pinned post soon where you can just add them in there. And keep an eye out for them because who knows when you're going to show up in one of my videos. Great photos you guys have been sending in and uh, keep up the good work. So i got to take off otherwise my camera is going to shut me down. So vape on vape heads. Break it down, just like my mechanical Cigarettes are poison, and I got the antidote It's called vaping, it's called escaping From that sick addiction that keeps on taking Minutes off your life, the gimmicks are just hype No need for a decision, I did it cause it's right Try it for two weeks and tell me how you feel Blow a couple